check this out. Now there's not only one SF90 in the A12, but there's two and another Portofino. And then over on this way, the ultimate, the Ferrari La Ferrari. This isn't the normal red on a Ferrari. This is kind of like a darker paint, which looks absolutely sick. Damn, this thing is sick. One of 499 worldwide. One of three cars from the Holy Trinity, including obviously the LaFerrari 918 and the McLaren P1, which were the first three cars from all companies to become hybrids. Here comes the wide body blue Euros from last night with all the carbon. That's clean. Hey, that's sick, bro. Oh. Four or five inch spider. Oh. Come on, 720. That's a 5AG Speed Legends right there. I'm gonna get down and record that. There is a Koenigsegg CCX being unloaded as we speak. Okay, that's crazy. Here, let's watch it leave real quick. That's insane. Holy sake, CCR. As I was saying, that's insane. But this is a 1 of 5 Mercedes AMG GTR Speed Legend. The Kona Sake is cool, but when you're, when you're in the presence of such a car that's one of five that just came out with no roof, you go pretty insane. Let's get a startup on this thing. I mean, I'm sure it's not gonna be too different, but you know. There you go, not bad. That's pretty decent. Whoa. Yes. Sounds so different from all the other GTRs. That's insane. Oh, this thing is insane. Oh, oh my god, I just realized it went on the curb. Wow, what a car. We had to chase it here. Over and over, over to Canary Row. This thing is insane. Wow. Never chased so much after a car in my life. The one thing I noticed with all these cars is that 99% of them are for on Montana or Texas plates. But check this out. Known to be made around 1,000 or 1,100 CGTs worldwide, 
In black, I don't know how many, but this is one crazy ass car. You know, this is something that only happened during Monterey Car Week where you have a Carrera GT. Just casually parked, windows rolled down, and probably not even locked. I'm not gonna try it, but it's probably not even locked. Holy, listen to these Lambos in the GT2 RS. Ooh, red wheels on the 2 RS, but this Huracan. This is sick. Holy shit. I knew I heard some of something else that was crazy. A Noventador is sitting right here. Look at that. That is what I'm talking about. This is car week. You have to have an Aventador, otherwise it's not car week. How good, how are you? That GG3 is not sock. Ooh, that F8 is nice. Ooh, this thing sounds crazy. Se Orange 720 on the Brixton Forge with downpipes. Oh, all right. Oh, 12C, as you do. YR8 V10 Plus with silver wheels, not bad. Not a bad spec. Other than, other than the debadging, it's pretty cool. And here come the GT3, the 2RS, Huracan, and Aventador all together. Look at that, wow. That Aventador is insane, man. Wow. There is nothing better than when you have a GT3, a GT3 RS and another 3 RS all right next to each other. Oh, you can't forget the La Ferrari. Catching the same little La Ferrari leave now from downtown, not the hotel. Once again, this car is amazing. This is definitely one of my dream cars for the future. Dude, this car is so amazing. I cannot wait to have my right next to my other dream car. Wow. Making sure it doesn't scrape. And there you go with the Huracan right behind it. Looking like a little toy compared to it. Whoa, with the three RS close behind. Door out of nowhere, matte black. Car week is the only week where you will see a Lexus LFA, McLaren Speedtail, Celine S7, Zonda R, Konus ACCX, Bugatti EV110, Jag XJ220 all together. Had to come take a look over here. There is a green McLaren P1. Just casually GT3 McLaren GT GT4 300 SL 720S P1 and how many more? It's a quick startup. Look at the wing. That's really cool. Everybody's going mental after the P1, which is also ironically his plate. Green P1 with silver wheels. 
What an interesting combo. That plate is the best thing I've ever seen. Crowd for this P1. Gotta see this thing go down. Oh. Wow, look at that. That plate though. No other place in time in the world will you find a 300 SL sitting on the side of the street worth $1.3 million. Of course, you know, it has to be on Montana place, but look at that plate. It says diamond, and that exhaust does not look very stock. And that is a Brabus G63 with right in front of it, a 488, and a Liberty Walk Aventador. Now this, this is what you would call a lineup. We have a Brabus. AMG G63, a Ferrari 488 GTB with a purple kind of blue, and then the Lamborghini Aventador Liberty Walk kit. It's the homie. Listen to his burble tune. There you go. Very, very nice. The casual car week spot with the R35 and the 4GT Mark II coming right in. This is like what, the 10th Ford Mark II 4GT coming right through? That's amazing. That's orange actually. Oh, nice. Oh my god. Oh, Holy shit! My Aventador SV, that was insane. I've never heard a louder car. You can still hear it. Back on Ocean Avenue, starting it off with this beautiful Audi R8. This red McLaren MP4 12C Spider is actually one of my friend's cars that he just got like a week ago. So this car is definitely gonna be on the channel very, very soon. Now this is what I want, a Ventador SV Roadster. Now this is what Car Week is about. 750 horsepower, single clutch transmission, 700 pound feet of torque, and with the price tag of like, Five hundred thousand dollars, yeah, because the SVJ is out, so it went down a little bit. But honestly, I, look at the plate, insecure. That's pretty cool. But honestly, even with the SVJ out, I think the SV is more. Even I mean, I haven't ridden in one, but I feel like it's more raw than an than SVJ. Holy! Holy. <laughs> this is what everybody comes to Car Week for: McLaren F1. Just casually, $20 million sitting right in front of everybody here. More people starting to come for quite the car. So this is not a real LM. It just has the wing, but holy. Check out the little toy car. That's really cool. It matches the exact spec of this F1. There's still a hundred of these believed to be in existence out of 106 and this is chassis number 14. Something is here and it sounds amazing. It looks like we have an Aventador SV in the back. Very, very nice. Oh, that's really nice. And this, oh no, not the SV. I thought it was the SV. Wow, Aventador Roadster 50th anniversary. Yo! Holy! Listen to this thing idle! Holy crap! That's insane. Yes, sir. Door 
Thumbs up. Now it's silent. Not a very stock R8 parking behind another not very stock Audi R8. Check that out. Huge, almost hit that wall, but huge wing. Wow, that's nice. That one, I take that one honestly.